hello friends i am back with my next video and this is a continuation of yesterday's conversation about being stuck in a game which you are playing and which is extraordinary far from reality right now but still you are playing so so i spoke about finding the gap restoring the intentionality restoring the integrity restoring the possibility you are in that game and seeing an opening for action that can help you uh, no, uh, come out of that situation where you think that you're stuck and you don't see it's moving and the pace is not as great as expected the results are not as great as expected so this is when uh, you have uh, like a goal for a month or two or maybe a quarter where you can have weekly milestones or daily milestones or week on week you can look at your gaps and you know, uh, restore the intentionality and you know, possibility of the game and uh, it's like a health check a review check like are you uh, keeping the pace and are you in the game uh, with um, as per the outcomes or the promises that you had set for week on week or day on day so it's like a health check and you re you're checking yourself like are you really making the progress that you expected so now when it comes to big games um, like a, a year long or maybe five years or ten years long then uh, you can have these checkups done every three months like a quarterly check where you can really see like you know, again uh, the gaps you know, the impact uh, what is the self-talk going on is it really inspiring you or it is giving you pain and because now it has become significant that you win this game so yes so when we become significant it becomes a uh, pain and we run into a different game than what we had set ourselves for so yes so three months check is important and three months in the game you can really see that the measurable outcome or the promise that you have set is really really realistic or and considering the circumstances and conditions around you is 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 that still uh, achievable and if not if you think that the current conditions and the next three months it is something that is not achievable then you can look at or it may even sound obsolete at that point so you can give yourself the opportunity to review revoke those scores or the goals or the measures that you have set and make it real make it realistic achievable and something that you can win so uh, reviewing or revoking a score is an option you can use when you're playing um, extraordinary games and the games are for a longer time span at least more than three months at least uh, let's say maybe we can look at not three months but a year long game where you can divide it into, into four quarters and three three months on you can check like you know, yes you can give a health check like where you are what you promised what is the gap in fact you know? check the possibility check the intentionality check the integrity you know? is is the goals still achievable with the challenges and you know opportunities around and if you think that it has become obsolete and not realistic then give yourself the opportunity to revive and revoke the measures and recreate the possibility and game so that for the next three months it it becomes fun and exciting again rather than a stress and pain so this is about uh, you know longer games and yesterday as i spoke about being stuck you know, and that is about small games or maybe where you are having daily and weekly goals uh, uh, or a very particular condition where you see that things are not moving or like it may be a month on month you can see that you know, it's not moving as uh, as expected so 
so again uh, uh, whatever plan you have made it has to be at least three months long your goals your milestones and mini milestones should be at least you know, three months long so that you give yourself complete time and bandwidth to really make a progress you know make a make a significant jump or move in the game to really measure it so it should not be like you know, a fast track or you know, uh, it should not be too hard uh, that don't be too hard on yourself so yes you can have extraordinary goals and games but you know, check the reality of it is it you know is it something that you can do it or it's just that you are a dreamer and you are having so unrealistic uh, goals that you, know, you never achieve it and you always find yourself uh, like you are just dreaming about things and hoping about things so yeah uh, that, so that is about uh, long games big games where you ha can have quarterly check and opportunity to revive and revoke your goals and make it intentional achievable exciting and uh, empowering again so my game uh, uh, as i said in my last video i will share it is about impacting 1 billion people in a 10 years time through my business and services and my mini milestone for this year is 100 million people in 10 different countries and yes i am in a team where i am uh, working with 10 leaders from 10 so definitely my game is up and I am impacting millions of people but I haven't reached my 100 million uh, mark but I am taking efforts and opportunities, uh, creating opportunities and taking action to you know, uh, connect to many people and impact them. So these Facebook videos are also part of these action items which will contribute to those 100 million people I am so in reality my gap is huge so at this moment i am you know i have only achieved one million but the the, the rest of the 99 million in another three months time is an unrealistic goal so yes but i am not reviewing or revoking my goal uh, i am going to still play my game with same enthusiasm I will consider reviving it by the end of December so that I can shape the scores for the coming years because my game is long it's a 10 year game and 1 billion people is a big number so I simply divided it into 10 years so which makes it 100 million for this year so I am still enthusiastic about playing my game through my uh, business and services I am I will be impacting these many people and uh, I'm on my game is on I'm continuing so I will consider reviving end of the end of uh, December this year because that will allow me to have achievable goals for the next year and so forth so you never know what kind of opportunities will show up because as long as you are in the possibility of the game like for me i being a global leader and global influencer and continuing to play my role continue to play my game uh, as the possibility i am so i am intentional and i am taking uh, actions daily and i am creating where I can create team and teamwork in a way that this number is achievable. Like this hundred million people uh, being impacted by my business and services is achievable in 2020. So that's the game I'm playing. And as long as it, the game gives you a charge, the game gives you an inspiration, empowerment, possibility, and intention. Then you, you are in and 
any time if you see the goals that you have set is draining you, stressing you out or pulling you, uh, giving you pain, then I think it is not the game that you're playing. Somewhere it has become significant, the goals have become significant and you have run into a self-talk which is giving you pain. So you need to catch and these review checkpoints like maybe it could you can do it a week on week or maybe month on month to really see where you are so this is again uh, something that is to introspect like how are you playing the game how is it impacting you and uh, is it really helping whatever you're doing is it really contributing to the game or is it really draining you out so these checkpoints are important and always give opportunity and the power to create uh, the reality uh, which is um, possible, uh, relatable and you know something uh, what to say that makes sense uh, and it, it, is, uh, it is it is something achievable rather than something you know, far away from uh, far away from what uh, is possible so having a mix of being relatable, achievable, yet extraordinary and unrealistic at this moment is uh, is something that you need to really see. Like I am not telling that I will be in, on Jupiter in another 10 years. Uh, no, it, it should not be like that. Uh, but yes, I know. Uh, uh, something that is possible I don't know in other 10 years there could be miracles happening and you know, we have no idea that we can really see uh, that is possible so yes uh, a mix of reality um, uh, and uh, possibilities which are achievable and you know, which, which make sense make, you know, make a real uh, is, is something that we have to keep in the background of the mind rather than because we our energy the hard work that we put in should not drain us out so create extra, extraordinary goals uh, you can even think of miracles uh, which are achievable and yes it's all about the mindset it's all about the intention that you have and uh, we can also set set ourselves up for magic and miracles so nothing wrong about that but as long as it gives you uh, inspiration it excites you encourages you it's good to go the only point where you have to check in like it should not become another chase story another race where you, you know, get exhausted drained working hard every day so the realities of the future that we are creating are powerful extraordinary they should pull us into that future and it, it, it powers us it inspires us and it you know, it doesn't you know, drain you out so this kind of a health check on your mindset is really important when you are playing big games long games so so do that and uh, drop me a comment if you are playing a big game like i am and uh, let me know so thank you so much for watching and next uh, tomorrow i'm going to create a new series uh, of videos uh, there is a new topic i'm going to introduce so stay tuned see you bye, -bye.